hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys we are going to troubleshoot the issue hp laptop touchpad is not working on your windows 10 11 or any other operating system so how to troubleshoot this issue guys step by step i will guide you so let's assume you are not able to move your cursor here so in order to do that you can use the additional mouse if you have okay this one is for the mouse if someone has the mouse so they can directly connect and they can directly open the device manager from there if you don't have the mouse here so what you need to do is you need to press windows plus x key together windows plus x key together like this and use your down arrow key to locate the device manager and hit enter once you have selected that once you have selected use the tab key on your keyboard okay like this highlighted option you can see hp laptop and use your down arrow key now like this and locate the option mice and other pointing devices use your right arrow key to expand that okay right arrow key once you expand that with the right arrow key again choose the down arrow key okay and look for elan click pad or the touchpad related driver just hit enter once you have selected that now we need to go to the drivers options here so again use your tab arrow key and now we are on in the general so use the right arrow key now now we are in the driver so use your tab arrow key to down okay now it's highlighted now use the down arrow key again okay we need to again use the tab arrow key down arrow key is not working here so use tab again okay and just hit enter once the update driver is selected there search for the first option and hit enter so once it is downloaded guys check if your issue is fixed or not but make sure you have to connect with the network in order to work this option if this option is not working let me close this and again choose this option this time down arrow key hit enter second option this one okay and choose here the latest driver from here the first list and click on hit enter so once you have manually installed the driver it will work just you have to restart the system okay and just use your tab arrow key to close this now or if you have updated the latest driver so you can roll back to your driver if that is not working as you can see it is asking to restart so enter on your keyboard and then hit yes option and then check if it is working fine or not if the issue was related to driver it will instantly fix your issue so you have to enter here in order to restart the system and for the other people who are able to use the mouse just follow this step also okay and also we can click on this option if you have the mouse and look for action scan for hardware changes and see if this option is fixed the issue or not if this option is not showing here you can go to view and show hidden devices okay and then go to the human related drivers here uh, let me show you where we can find it human interface devices okay and look for mouse related driver here and touch pad related driver here the driver name should be like this click pad or hid mouse related so you have to update those drivers from here like this okay and simply update them since i have this driver inside here so i'm not able to find it out from here but you should able to find out that okay so i hope this option will will work for you most of the system but if you have still issue guys so i'm assuming that you are still not able to move your cursor here so what you need to do is we need to check for updates sometime old windows or pending windows can cause many issues so you have to press windows plus i key together in windows 10 and 11 also like this and we need to 
use the tab arrow key okay as you can see down now down and look for update and security hit enter now we need to go to the check for updates so let me show you here how we can do that okay now use the tab arrow key two times and hit enter so once you hit enter it will check for update okay once it is updated it will also install the other drivers also which are pending and it will fix your issue if not now the third move on to the third step guys so somehow we need to go to the open the google chrome here okay so in this case guys you have to use the mouse here and we need to type here hp driver download and hit enter basically we need to download the hp driver download touchpad driver from the manufacturer website in this step go to first link and even you can follow these steps in other manufacturer as well but i have dedicated this video regarding the hp so i'm showing you the about the hp and in here guys we need to enter serial number product number or product name so you can find out it like you can press here the function plus escape key and this will be the serial number and let me show you also locate your like this serial number is showing should be showing like this product name is this option so once you have got that number manually enter that and i can also show you to open the command prompt press windows plus r button type cmd okay and we can also get the serial number with the command prompt here like this tap wmi wmi c bios get serial number together like this and hit enter once you hit enter just copy the serial number like this press control c on your keyboard and just paste it here so once you have pasted it here it will scan for this so let me also type here the serial number not serial uh, model number to show you hp pavilion i'm using here let me go to the system ms info 32 okay we can also enter here the model number product number as well so three sixty convertible as you can see like this okay I'm just showing you how you can navigate in order to install the touchpad driver okay it is showing now as you can see here on uh, this option this is the model number select your operating system here guys so these are the genuine steps to troubleshoot these kind of issues step by step this may take time but you need to make sure you follow these steps carefully and i i should suggest to guys just update the bios driver as well here but this is the second not the priority one first we need to go to the this option driver keyboard mouse and input devices expand this option simply and in here guys look for 
touch pad related driver as you can see here this is the latest driver showing here hit download and just install them as you can see this option you can also try this option eel and touch pad driver okay so you need to click on one by one you can choose many of the drivers here some supporting drivers also here but i should recommend you to choose the latest driver here first and then if that is not working look for other driver also later the touchpad and see which one is working for you or not so i'm pretty sure guys after applying this method your issue is going to fix and you are good to go if still not working you have to look for the hardware changes if you have made okay and see if any wire disconnected from the motherboard so in this that case you need to go to the service center so i hope guys you, your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share and also you can join the membership 